In this video, I'll show you how to connect a USB drive to your Mac Mini M4. So let's get started. Well, first of all, there's two types really of USB drive, one with a USB type A connector, and then you have those with a USB type C connector. If you have one of these, it's very easy. You just have to connect it to one of these ports in the front or the ones in the back. If you have one that has a USB type A connector, in that case, you'll need an adapter. Apples are selling this one, which is USB type A to USB type C, and it works quite well. I'll put a link in the description, but there's many other brands making these that are also reliable. It's very important that your USB drive is actually formatted in a way that the Mac is able to read it, because the Mac is not compatible with all formats. So to format your drive, you need to go on the top where you see a magnifying glass, click on it and type disk utility. Usually it should be one of the first options appearing in the search. So click on it once it's there. And then on the left side, you're going to see your USB drive. Mine is this one. This is its name. It's formatted in FAT32, so I don't have to reformat it to be compatible with my Mac. But if you want to format your drive, first of all, make a backup of it because everything will be lost. And then you're going to press, once you have selected it, erase. You will be able to give a new name to this drive. And then you're going to choose in which format you want this drive to be in. As I said before, if you choose uh, Mac, if you choose XFAT, this is a great way if you want to connect this drive to a Windows and a Mac. If you choose these over here, Mass o Mac OS Extended, it will not be compatible with Windows devices once it's formatted like that. So XFAT or FAT32, in my opinion, are the best options, really. I won't do it now, but once you're ready, simply press, press erase. It will take just a few seconds and your drive will be formatted. If you want to transfer files from that USB drive to your Mac, you need to open the Finder app. It's this one over here. Click on it. And on the left side, you're gonna see your USB drive. If you click on your USB drive, you're gonna see everything that is on it. If you want to transfer something from your USB drive to the desktop, you simply have to drag and drop. You can also drag and drop anything by selecting them and dragging them in one of these folders of here, document, desktop, maybe not application, but in the future, you may have more folders of yours here. So you can simply drag and drop there. You can copy and paste them like on any computer. So select the files. You can right click to appear, to make appear a small menu to select copy, but you can also select your files, then go into edit in the top left corner, then copy, then go into another folder on your Mac. And once you're there, go in edit and paste. Once you're done using your USB drive, it's important to eject it before removing it physically from the Mac mini. Over here, you see there's a small icon on the right side of your USB drive. Click on it. It usually takes a few seconds and the USB drive will disappear from the finder. And then you can safely go ahead and disconnect it from your Mac. So this is it. I hope this was useful. If so, please leave a like, subscribe, comment down below, and I'll see you in the next video.